Alrighty, welcome back everybody. So today I'm bringing you guys here the English versus the French. Uh, very epic tales, you know what I mean? Alright, so who are we actually at? You were perfect. This is the English side here. Again, we always go for the English. We might change that later on, but right now that's our trademark, so we're gonna go for it. Alright, he's micromanaging. No. <clears throat> he was in the beginning, but now he's not. There you go. What else we got here? So he's going for food. One house. Yes, one house. Should be going for gold. There you go. Beautiful. The gold mark. He's probably making citizens directly to gold. Yes, he is. Okay, that's beautiful. Perfect. Everything he needs. Two or three to gold. The rest in, in food. Then we're going to go up on H. So this is the, you know, double. This is the usual right here. The French, the French are coming. All right, here we go. All right, we got gold. One, two, three gold mines. Wow. So this map right here has a lot of gold. And uh, they seem to be like the 4,000 kind. So right there in front of him it's right there five six this is crazy this is nice okay this the scout it stopped i don't know if you knew but okay you're good to go there on the department all right let me hear you guys okay <clears throat> the crispy cream Okay, one guy, two guys on wood. I, this is what I usually do. I know it takes longer to go to the next age, but when, when you do, uh, you get to create a bowman right away. You don't have to wait. You know, you don't have to swap anything. You're already producing wood for the barracks or for, for an outpost, for whatever you like to do with that. So I like it this way. I don't know. All right, so all right, what else? What else you got going on? In the beginning of all the games, the same thing, the same routine. You go around, you're looking for the enemy. In this case, if you're trying to rush, which I don't think he is, he would have gone directly straight for the enemy. So I know that this this type of player most likely will not rush. He's not actually looking for the enemy. Okay, he's going to create a meal right here, close to the animals. He knows the animal animal food um, production is quicker or higher than anything else. So he's going to go straight for the animals. Power move right there. Okay, we're ready for to go to the next age. By the looks of the food production here, the all the, the French is are already trying to go to the second age. Now we should put everybody there. Yep, everybody that comes out needs to start constructing. This is a military building. So this is the one that gets you 100% production rate when it comes to bowmen which is nice it doesn't charge extra you just make sure oh he should have killed all the animals so he could stay put okay you found the enemy they're almost done with the military landmark as well all righty then uh the french will take out the cal calorie units right away just the same as the, the bowmen for the French, for the English. So the, those are two things you guys got to watch out for when you guys are fighting the French. They all have cavalry units right away. So you have to get your spearmen ready right from the beginning, right from the get-go. Uh, what do we got here? So look, 18 out of 20. Uh, you guys, yep, there you go. He's creating a new house. Should have definitely killed the animals so they wouldn't run away. All right, what else you got going on? Done. Now, when these buildings are getting constructed, I... I don't... I have never looked at the fact that actually it slowly puts things together on the building. And I just I just realized that, you know, look, see, the roof is already on it. So pretty much it's almost done. Wow. Attention to detail. I love it. I love it. Okay, so let's go back here. Uh, what else? What else? You got people here. Okay, getting wood. Perfect. Okay, what else? Okay, you guys are gonna go straight for wood. So you have... 
Are you gonna create a couple of long, long ball man, please? Now, look at the description of low, long ball man. Cheap, long range infantry with good damage versus unarmored targets. So if they're armor, you have to go for crossbow. And this guy right here, this is for anything and everything. <laughs> so yeah. <clears throat> I think in this case, okay, forest, okay, beautiful. He's actually, uh, he has, he needs to get this one though. Double broad axe, uh, increases villagers gathering rate of wood by 15% percentage wise. So those are the ones that we definitely have to do. He has the barracks, so he's going to have a spearman ready for the French. The French are guarantee you that they're getting ready to, you know, with the cavalry units. They're going to be harassing the English. I think right there you see that you did you see that did you see that how quickly that came to be all right get all of your so here's here's the thing here's the thing he's trying to finish off this guy right here so here's the thing Ah, the, the citizens are at risk. I would have already pulled them back a long time ago. So look at that. Look at the, look at the French. The French are actually rushing this guy completely out of the gold mine. Just for the simple fact that they could do cavalry units right away from the beginning. Which is, you know, it is what it is. We all knew that this was what the French were capable of doing. And I think uh, the English should have prepared themselves for it. Look at that. They are getting hammered, man. There you go. He's gonna sacrifice this one unit here. I would have. I don't like sacrificing my units. I would have taken them back. I don't care. Ah, what else we got going on? So he's trying to get back on the game, <clears throat> which is usually what I always say that you know mentally you break down before the game is over. So this harassment by the French, he it might have a toll mentally. So if the French came back here and they're hiding in the back, bro, they're gonna be able to do some crazy damage when these people move out here to the mills. I'm just letting this guy know. So the next thing that we should be thinking about is uh, blocking the size. You know, a wooden fence wouldn't kill him. This is nice. He put her here because he was, you know, he was getting rushed. But he should have actually, if he had the chance, he would have put it here, or maybe here to see, you know, if they were getting the gold, you know, things like that. But now this one here was just because he needed to put it down to put the archers inside or the villagers themselves. So, it's understandable. So, the French did uh, really well. Let's see if we could... Um, if we could get on top of them. You know what I mean? Like, they are right now... They are... Ahead of the game. Let's put it that way. Okay, he's logging down the side. That's good. Okay, the French are coming for the villagers. Run. Run, forest! Run, forest! So yeah, the French are definitely going straight for the villages, which is nice. It's definitely what you have to do. So here we are. Get the gold of the villagers. Ah, put them inside. Woo! Damn, they got both of them just like that. So yeah, if, if our guy right here doesn't change the strategy, I think we're in trouble. He's getting the villagers killed. Uh, I don't know what to tell you people, I don't know. I don't know if he's going to be able to make it though. We'll see, we'll see. I don't want to call it... I don't want to call it quits, but...
Yeah, I don't want to call it quits, but wow, the French are cleaning this English player. Um, so basically, this player here is coming again, and bam, see that? He already has it there on the side. <laughs> Alright, so technically the player on top for sure is the French. So he's gonna stay there, put down by himself. Boom 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 boom. Waiting for the harassment. He's gonna come for the for the Yep, that wait, why are you stopping? You had them right there. What? Okay, here we go. Okay, you guys gotta keep the. Come on, do it, do it, do it. Okay. Oh, the wolf is doing his thing. Everybody's doing their thing right now. So look at the spearman. The spearman is trying. Yep. Okay. I don't want to. I don't want to go there. This is getting extremely. Uh, Okay, instead of putting it there, you should have closed down this one right here. Right here would have been the one. Damn. Look at them. They're getting the health back. That's that's a horrible thing to see. Damn, this guy is in trouble. We all know it. Uh, let me see what else we got going on here. This is horrible. He should have not put that there. He should have put it right here. What's the matter? What's the matter? See, they're coming. They're coming. Now, oh, put them inside. Put them inside. Nice. Matter of fact, if you can put another one, you know you already have too many. Oh, go back, go back. They're gonna get you again. Damn, from both sides. How did he come in through here? Because you didn't actually close it down. Damn, this game is straight up for the French. I don't know what else to tell you, people. See that? He can't be in two places at once. So what he needs to do. Yeah, he's actually charging them, which is a great way to get ambush. He's trying to finish off this right here. The one that has 21 HP left. But that's a great way to get ambush. So I would have definitely let them go, man. Close that down. Let them go. If you like, grab your archer, shoot this guy, bring them closer. Hopefully, you know, you get to bait them into. So at this point right now, we have a ton of uh, food. Zero gold. He noticed that. I think he's going to do something differently now. Let's see. Let's see. No, actually no. I guess I was wrong. I don't know. This is not... It's not ideal, man. He's getting hammered down. They're gonna go now for the villagers. He has the villagers to sit in there. Yeah, he gave in into the pressure from the other player. From the French uh, player. And... Um, yeah, I think I would have done the same thing though. Uh, if I if I got this game halfway or in the middle, I would have done the same thing. All right, here we go. Military count. So military count. Yep, the, the English player was trying, but the French knights were extremely strong. So of course, you know, downfall economy wise. Yep, he just kept getting interrupted, so he kept going down. 
uh, food production, it was crazy high. He actually should have actually consumed all of that. Wood production. Wow. I guess the French don't need the wood. And then the gold, of course. The French were doing extremely well. Uh, not bad, not bad, but not good. The French could have done so many things differently. But then again, I guess he was under pressure. So I get good game for all, both of you. Um, I'll leave you guys with this one here. See you guys in the next one. And again, before I leave, we are 91 subscribers. Our goal is to get to 100. Thank you for your support. And I'll see you in the next one.